was listening to the radio. I know, crazy sentence to say in 2024. But anyway, Sarah was listening to the radio, and they're having a conversation about the ridiculous things that brides request of their bridesmaids. And one particular topic that they were talking about, there was this bride who requested or told her bridesmaids, you are not allowed to get pregnant until after my wedding. Now, I don't know what the window was. I guess, obviously, the point is, don't show, don't, I don't want you pregnant on my wedding day. I don't want you, I don't want you showing on my wedding day. And she told the bridesmaids, I just don't think it's a flat, it's going to be unflattering in the dress. Very problematic. And also, I don't want anyone taking the attention off of me and my day and me and my husband. And this is our day. I don't want any attention to be taken off of us. Um, for you to tell to imply that pregnant women look unflattering. Um, that, that's a whole nother conversation for a whole nother TikTok video that we're not going to talk about right now. But it opened up a can of worms of the ridiculous things that brides request of their bridesmaids. Now, there was people calling in and texting in who were actually agreeing with this bride and saying, well, it's her day. If that's her request, then that's okay. No. Absolutely not. If somebody requested of me to not get pregnant, I don't care if I'm in or out of a relationship, if I'm actually trying to get pregnant or not. If you request that of me, I like we can't be friends. Like but the friendship is just over at that point because obviously we are not operating on the same wavelength. We're not on the same page. We're not even the same library. Okay, so we, like I, I think I just would have to respect respectfully uh respectively respectfully in the friendship right then and there because what, 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 what else are we talking about because that's a lot there's a and okay so now in one girl's defense one bride who said that she agreed and she actually um asked her matron of honor not to get pregnant but she asked her matron of honor not to get pregnant because she wanted to be able to drink and have fun and party with her friend. That's a little bit different than telling someone, I don't want you pregnant because you're going to look unflattering in your dress and your pregnancy is going to steal the thunder away from my day. Babe, now, look, obviously, people who, who are right up here, people who have a quarter of a brain, who are not uh, jealous and vindictive or, or rude and nasty, most people go into a wedding or go to a wedding with a conscious mind of I'm not trying to steal their thunder it is not about me it is about them let me not do anything to draw attention to myself that's understandable but how far is too far so I want to ask you guys what are some crazy things that you've been asked to do being a bridesmaid or a groomsman or what is something that you heard of that you experienced that you were like i can't believe the bride asked them to do that how far is too far do you feel like she was okay to make their request is she justified um you know would you still be friends with this person would you still talk to this person like i you know you hear some crazy things about the things that people request of their bridesmaids and it's just like girl relax like, if you're that worried about someone stealing your thunder, maybe seek help. Now, in the same breath, I will say, I'm not going to sit up here and act like and get up here on a pedestal. There was a, a one time I did, I did, you know what I'm saying? I'm going I'm to go ahead and tell on myself. I did one time purposely, um, you know, not, I. okay, how can I say this? <laughs> Okay, I didn't try to steal the attention off the bride on purpose. I didn't. But I did go in with an attitude of, um, I, I'm about to slay the house down boots. I'm about to knock them dead. I'm, I'm going to knock. I, 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 I didn't go in with the attention to steal the attention. I didn't look at me stuttering. Oh, just lying, just lying, just lying for no reason. I didn't go in fully with the intention of, Oh, I'm I'm about to steal the attention off of her day. But I didn't not. But that's a that's a story time for another day. If y'all want that story time, then you know, whatever. But I, I didn't do I I didn't do nothing crazy or anything like that. I just you know, I'm a beautiful girl. <laughs> Anyways, that's another story. The point is, I was younger. I, it was it, it it was layered. It was a lot more elements to that. But if y'all want that story time, I'll be more than happy to give it to you. But anyways, share with me. Um, if you are a wife now, or if you've been married before, and 
is there anything that you requested of your bridesmaids that you look back on now that you're like, wow, why did I ask them to do that? That was really a lot. Have you ever been that girl or got to go to a wedding with the intention of trying to steal thunder? You know, let's be honest. I look, look I was honest. Look, I'm just, I look, I'm speaking from just sitting. I'm speaking from, uh, you know, experience of, you know, both sides of the coin. But yeah, y'all do y'all out here doing too much and telling people to not get pregnant. That's that's doing a lot. But also understand, I don't think you really need to say that. In most cases, obviously weddings are planned well out. Um, you have a lot of notice on when the wedding is going to be, and typically bridesmaids um, get their um, dresses well in advance meaning you get sized and fitted and, and alterations done to fit. So most women are not trying to get pregnant during that time because they don't want to be up there looking like a blimp. I'm sorry. that Y'all know what I'm saying. For one, you spend all this money on this dress and stuff. You're not trying to get pregnant. Uh, you know, stuff happens, but most women are not because you've already bought your dress. You got alterations you know, it, it's it's going to turn into a, a, a whole thing. So you really don't even really need to make that request. Um, then you have some women telling bridesmaids, you can't, you can't, you got to stay within this certain weight. You can't gain weight. You can't lose weight. You got to be this weight. And it's just like, you know, you, you, you don't, you're doing a lot. You're doing a lot. And, you know, when you start getting to the point where you just, you gotta really ask yourself, am I asking this stuff to be rude? Am I hurting someone's feelings? Like, this is ridiculous. We're not talking about models on a, a, a photo shoot. You know what I'm saying? We're not talking about a, a movie role or um, a job that requires some type of weight limit or appearance or something. Yeah, it's your day, man. Chill out. But anyway, so that's just my take on that. But yeah, let me know some interesting stories about these uh, crazy brides and stuff or, you know, anything that we talked about today. Okay, bye.